When using the internet, we use domain names. These addresses are important parts of the infrastructure of modern society, but sometimes conflicts arise. Conflicts about the domain name itself, or regarding content or services that the domain leads to. While conflicts about names often are easily solved, conflicts about content are more complex. Ideally, you may want to shut down the content, but that is not always possible. Internet is international, and the content may be in a different country. As a last resort, you may take down the domain name, but this is like removing road signs in order to keep people from getting to a house where illegal activity is going on. It doesn't stop the activity, it just makes it harder to find. In addition, it may have unintended consequences. Removing a domain affects everything within it. This is good if all the content and services are illegal. But innocent third parties may be harmed as well. In worst case, their domains stop working because the roadmap to the services they depend on disappears. The guide about domain conflicts and the legal system describes who does what in case of a conflict and where you can find help or advice. What does and does not happen when a domain is deleted and which unintended consequences can there be? What is technically possible to do with a domain name and which legal possibilities and limitations are there? This guide provides you with insight into a topic where direction easily can be lost.